Hey Boogers, welcome back to the channel. I'm going to do a comment for comment video. And of course, you know, I have QA questions too as well. But I'm going to answer comments for comments to let you guys know what I feel like need to be discussed on my YouTube channel. So y'all continue to have a blessed Thursday. Enjoy the video. Hey Boogies, welcome back to Nika's Busy Life in 10 edition, baby. What is going on, son? You know what I said? Today is officially Thursday. I just did laundry at home. I'm about to go ahead and fix these kids something to eat right quick, like. But anyways, I don't always eat in front of my kids and don't give them what I have. But every time I eat, I don't have to give them what I have. They have two boxes of pizza in the kitchen. Let's address that now. Everything a parent eats does not mean they have to give it to their kids because they're eating it. All right, let's get it correct. But I do give my kids things that I do have. But if I feel like I don't want to share my little bit of fries and one little tender, I don't have to. You know what I'm saying? Just for people on the internet, oh, you eat in front of your kids, it's not fair, you're selfish, you shouldn't do that. I give my kids everything. They eat their pizza, they eat whatever the hell they want, they go in stores all day, every day. I don't record every time we go in the store. We go in the store like three or four times a day. So I don't sit up there and be like, ah, oh, da, 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 blah, 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 nah, none of that going on. Anyways, I just jumped on here because I was bored and had nothing to do. I usually go live on TikTok and Instagram, maybe Facebook, but I stopped going live because there's too many haters out there. And like I said, a lot of people like, oh, well, y'all call people that's watching y'all haters. It's not that the YouTubers are calling people haters. It's, it's a such thing as haters on the internet. We're not calling the people that's watching us haters. It's just certain people that are haters, you know? So let's get that correct. But on here, it says, one of the comments was, Nika, you need a break from the kids. You are tired and you have no help. Can their dad take them for the weekend? That's a comment right there. I just read. Yes, he can't take them for the weekend, but his car broke down. So I guess he don't have the money to get it fixed right now. I guess. I'm not sure. So that's one thing that I seen um, that I will answer. Um, they say, I told you to give her a wing, a wing leg. That baby wants more than milk. The baby is only eight months, nine months. You can't just give her a leg where she can choke off of because she can't even chew. She got teeth in the bottom, two teeth in the bottom, but she can't even chew right now. So all she do is swallow everything she eats. So basically I give a baby food, a bottle, and sometimes mashed potatoes, sometimes grits. Sometimes if I eat a fry, I mash up and give it to her. I mean, I carry in the womb for nine months, push her out. Of course I can feed it out of my mouth. Um, Nikki, you need, a, okay, well, hold on. I mean, y'all are a big family. Laundry is bouncing and elegant. You just need to stay on top of it. You must have don't watch my channel. Let me let me address that. You must don't watch my channel at all because first of all, I do laundry every week and every time I do laundry, I do a video. Cause when I do a video, I go back on my um, studio and see how many times I do laundry in a day or in a week. I do laundry all the time. And what I do is my kids does have a bin they can put their laundry in. They choose to jump on top of it and break it. So when they break things, I don't go out and replace it. I make them put it in a bag and then we take it to the laundromat. So when they clean up their room today and I went in there and helped them clean it up, I got all their dirty clothes out that was left inside of their closet, which all kids does this. I've been a kid before too. I've done the same thing. I would take my dirty clothes, throw it under my bed or in my closet. So, I mean, they're kids. So I went in there and cleaned up their stuff. You also say you need, you also say, but hamsters can can throw them right in and not leave them all over the house okay plus it's easier for you to bring it to the laundry if i got hamsters yes i had baskets of course y'all didn't see the baskets because i had the baskets um i had already dumped most of the clothes in there but i had three baskets already um he's the only one wearing isaiah clothes isaiah's a boy a man can wear the same clothes all the time and change their underwear y'all ain't got nothing to say about that if a man walk around here with the same pants and shirt on all day long can you boys can wear the same clothes girls can't but they did get up this morning and washed down or whatever and got out here and got dressed. As long as their underwear is clean and their boxes, that's fine with me. But sometimes Isaiah does wear the same shirt because it's the same shirt. But he does change his clothes. And at the end of the day, y'all come up here dressing some of the dumbest stuff. Like, why are they wearing the same clothes? He is a boy. You know what I'm saying? Even my girls, they wear the same clothes. That means their underwears are clean. But if we run out the house, we all do it. We human beings. We all run out the house sometimes just to get everything done at one time and just leave. And not thinking about anything else, just get everybody's shoes on and let's go. You know what I'm saying? So, well, as as I seen Isaiah, that. Isaiah's not gonna listen. Isaiah got a shirt on that he likes, he's not gonna wanna take it off. We're not gonna make him take it off. We don't want to take it off. Thank you. Cause that's another thing too that she addressed that Isaiah has a certain pick of clothes that he likes to wear yeah. and he gets the attitude if he can't have that certain shirt on like for instance like Lena she likes her shoes a certain way if she don't like the shoes she'll find another pair of shoes or if she like to wear certain things she'll go pick out her own clothes for the day and she like mama I want to wear this okay that's fine that's what you want to put on as long as they clean then that's what that's what matters Jamie um said I said that I wish my bank account fill up faster like my laundry that is so true i wish the same thing but see bobby got my 
oldest daughter here most of the times like when things start to get a little bit rough and the check is not looking like it's supposed to from YouTube or you know I'm not getting the money that I need you know what I'm saying sometimes she steps in I'm like well let me borrow such and such from you to get all the laundry catch up because I didn't do laundry by myself today I got to give her the credit where it's due because she helped out with the laundry today you know what I'm saying with putting money towards things and helping me with the laundry today so that was a big help so yeah I wish mine were full up too as well Jamie girl I appreciate you girl one of my bookies as well Mm, girl, I know you have something better to put on them shirts. My shirt say yeah, baby, because that's my logo. That's the only thing I put on my shirt with yeah, baby. If you don't like it, then that's fine. I mean, a lot of people probably don't like what I have on my shirt. But it's something that my followers from TikTok had liked um, for me to put on my shirts. And yes, I do have yeah, just yeah, baby on my shirts. And my um, Instagram, because that's where my link tree is at. But if you don't like, I understand. I appreciate all your support as well. Watching my channel and seeing, you know, what I got hey, going on. Put yeah, baby, on the shirt. Show did. Like, huh? Okay, sh you can eat. She can eat her finger, her finger food oh. now in her new high chair. Yeah, you wipe out that gland. She can't eat her her favorite food. We gave her food last night in the chair. I didn't record. Oh my god, yo, she made a mess everywhere. I had to go in there and clean that chair after she was done. But I fed her. She on my back now. I know y'all see her. Hey, snake a butt. Last night I made a video of me just eating and say I want to thank all my supporters for supporting me. That's all I had to say last night. So somebody's like, what the fuck is this? That's what WF, WTF stands for. Um, somebody say beautiful shirts. Thank you, love. Appreciate it. Somebody say, I just want to know how many bedrooms are in the house. Why Naya sleep with you? No disrespect. Just a question. Um, basically, Naya does not live in the home anymore. She doesn't live here anymore. She only comes in and out every now and then. Stay a night or two and she leaves. But Naya has an outside job, so she doesn't be here. Uh, each one of the, the boys have a room together, and the girls, I have my own room. Then we have a laundry room. Then we have a little um, separate room for the guest area. But Naya does not be here, so Naya sleeps with me, but she do come here. Um, when y'all going to get her hair over GD? Um, that's some, I don't know. We don't do hair every damn time. Y'all say they need their hair done because y'all be like, oh, when they gonna get their hair done? If their hair is braided, we'll leave them by two or three weeks. We take it out, we wash it, we do something else to it. But we're not gonna do it every time somebody says something about their hair. Wash them bowls, hun. Them bowls are dirty. Okay, y'all saying bowls are dirty. When I fix the tacos or cereal, whatever I fix that day, I understand y'all might say it's dirty, but I do wash dishes and clean up my kitchen before I do it. That's because you came with no more than three kids. I have seen doctor's office do other family. And yesterday I took Leah to the doctor and they say that they let they go, they let them go back. Keeping it real, that's somebody who comment on my YouTube channel too as well. No, um, they will not let me go back because they said that Samari has to go back by herself even though she's 12 years old. I was kind of confused, but they did say I could not go back regardless if I had kids or not. Samari, I didn't sign no paper or nothing. She went back on her own and done everything on her own. So it was her decision to say, yeah, no, she wanted or not. Or whatever she wanted to do or however she wanted to do, they still say I could not come back regardless if I had my kids or not. So um, that was the issue yesterday. I was like, damn, okay, well, Samari, you go back and handle what you got to handle. And, you know, I'll sit outside and wait in the lobby. Why the girl's hair isn't done? Poor kids. Y'all always saying something about poor kids. These kids ain't poor. We ain't rich. We ain't fake. We ain't, we ain't none of that shit. We just doing what we need to do to survive. So their hair will get done as soon as I get ready to do their hair. Or, you know, when, when Naya gets time, we'll take it out and we'll do it. But they will get their hair cut and their hair done. But when it was with their father, they had to see him. And y'all wouldn't be talking all that smack because I'm doing twice as more than what he did when it was with him. You know what I'm saying? Even though, you know, he tried. It's like, I'm trying, but I know when it's time to do my kids' hair or cut their hair. But, you know, I appreciate the comment as well. Um, two o'clock, two minutes, Nika, she ain't even have too much. She was trying to chew life. And if they are asking for water, just give it to them. They need water. And if they don't like it because they are not used to getting it, they are, they are the children, not the parents. Mom. Understand that. And these are my children. Thank you. Mom, mm -hmm. I cannot, I cannot watch the girls. All right, in a minute. The daddy lying right next to you. So are you going to call? That's not the dad that was laying next to me last night. That was Naya. That's only for birth control. Regular doctors visit. You can go in the room with them. Yeah, regular doctors, you can go in the room with them. But for birth control, you cannot. That's still stupid because most of the time, they didn't even tell me if she was pregnant or not pregnant or whatever. Even though you go take a test, that's still supposed to be, I'm the parent. I'm supposed to know, you know, what the, what it is. Like, they still didn't come out there and tell me anything. They just let her do everything. So out of, out of respect. I'm her parent. I'm supposed to know, but they still didn't say nothing. So you're right about that part, too. They do let you go back when you're at the doctor's, but at the damn birth control center, they do not. But that's still wrong because she's only 12. Shaking my head, you is really 
delayed and slow you you know damn well there is no sugar free rain pops i can't with these slow people i ain't nothing slow about nikki i got more sense than you think i am um that's right sister amen my son need more discipline he's so small it's sad a lot of these kids fall nowadays that's why a lot of kids when they get up older they're killing their parents so they they have their way when they're little when they get up older they expect the same thing um and sometimes it's not that just the kids just want to have their way and, and just feel like they don't have to work for it or do anything that's where the discipline come in at all right four reasons she's at the age where she's having periods and an age where she can be active they take her back there alone to to make sure she's comfortable giving honest answers without feeling aware um aware because mom is sitting there okay it gives her one on um, one time with her daughter if she have questions or concerns they can address them for her three the room is not being big enough for you and all those kids they are not about to let you go back there while your children are in the waiting room unattended four who wants to be crowded in a small room with their siblings while getting an exam and asking personal questions i agree to all your questions and i think those are some positive questions and i do agree Mom. with you on these four Mom. main on these four main questions that you said in my comments and i really do appreciate all the respect that came from these comments and i'm not i don't have nothing negative to say about that because that's really true and i appreciate these comments that you put on there Mama. on there i appreciate Mama. that i said i put constant drive okay I baby was a baby. okay baby all right the iphone is not glued to your damn hand stop filming lena and pop her ass she's scared she must be the old man that's that's funny um why he got to sleep now why he got why he got to go to sleep now it's not like he has school in the a.m and why he couldn't have more none Isaiah just ate three bowls of cereal before I went and do my snack video. Isaiah has a habit of wanting everything that I eat and drink like everybody else does in the household. If I say no, no means no. I can't give my kids everything I eat like I just said in the first part of the video. But I appreciate the comment as well. Alright, um, those shirts look huge. I will take a large instead. Um, well, Keisha, I got you a large ready. Whenever you ready, baby, let me know and I can um, give it to you when we meet up. We're supposed to be meeting up soon, so I have a large for you. Don't do him like that. He wants some snacks to hell. Cause if your if it was your favorite, she would have been in the camera, mouth full. You're talking about Nana, I don't have a favorite. You're always saying Nana, my favorite, or Naya or Kaya. Those are not my favorite. I have a favorite. All ten of my kids are my favorite, okay? But I understand what you're saying too as well, but no, all of them are my favorite. When are you going when are you going to set up the beds and could not be comfortable for anyone with half a dozen in one bed? They all are comfortable in my bed. They love sleeping in my bed. I'ma set it up. I'ma set up once the mattress come in, y'all. It'll be here soon. Girl, why you didn't buy any towels with that bingo money you won? Um, I didn't buy no towels yet. I got towels. I just washed clothes, so I got a lot of towels. And that was not a baby towel that I gave her. It's like one of them toss um like them hand towels that I had on my registry. Alright. Um, that I had and the towel was not dirty. It looked like that, but it wasn't. Um, thank you, love. I appreciate that coming too as well. But nah, I got towels. Nika girl, you need to need your scratch those food stamps and we better so you can make bigger meals. It's also better to have leftovers than not enough. Two pieces even with eggs for lunch and ain't even enough. At least six pieces. I bet all of it gets eaten. Sometimes they get eaten, sometimes they don't. Sometimes they don't like pieces, but sometimes they do eat it. But you're right. I do cook big meals, but when I do cook, if I, I'm going to start showing y'all the after effect and y'all going to start talking shit that I throw out a lot of food every day when I do cook. What I don't understand is how you had all those kids knowing the daddy did not take care of the, the, the first babies, yet all y'all did was make more. Neither of you want to be adults and get jobs to support y'all kids. Sad. False. That's false. That's not true. The daddy been around since God knows when. He still help out when he can. Um, and I'm going to leave it like that. Give Leah the old phone. I already buying Leah an iPhone for her birthday. It's going to be a surprise gift for her. That's what she asked for and she want her nails done. So she is getting an iPhone for her birthday. Big and sickening. I don't know why you say that on my video when I was eating chips last night. People eat all the time. Just don't comment. Don't say nothing at all. They just look at the video. Beautiful on one of my videos. And then, would you make the shirts more affordable? Some people may not be able to purchase for $30. I think you can do $10 or $15. You can get more people to buy. I might drop the price. I'll see. Some people already buy. She begs for... Hush a minute. She begs for donations and has a registry. Kids in baggage and had hand-me-down clothes. Always eating pieces, sleeping on the floor. Her truck is literally falling apart. 
I don't think they fit her 20 kids. Kids need haircuts and healthy food. They always have juice and soda. Kids need water and veggies, not pizza, new house, no furniture, but new nails and phones. I feel for them kids. They ain't a bad ass, bad as hell. Some kids are still in diapers. I don't know names because it's so damn many. Some kids need to be in school, but what do you do? Uh, first of all, you done said a whole lot of shit. My nails got done. Hold on. My nails got done from one of my followers from Mother's Day gift. Two, my kids are not in handed down clothes. If clothes are given to my kids, those are used clothes. They'll be washed and they put on their back because I'm not a person that does not take things for, for my kids. Three, I'm, I'm in a new house and I've I worked my ass off to get to where I'm at. I'm going to take my time to get furniture in my house. There's no rush. And first of all, there's only two in diapers. One in diapers, that's um, South Asia. And Lena is in pull-ups and that's it. Um, and um, they do eat veggies. And yes, they're sleeping on the floor on air mattresses and um, a pilot on the floor. And they are sleeping on a futon bed. And three, my kids are well taken care of. I don't have no problem with my kids. And wherever they want to sleep, they want to sleep. Wherever they collapse, they're going to collapse. If they want to sleep on the floor, that's their problem. But I thank you for all your support and watching our channel. I appreciate you. Keep it moving. Me and you both need to quit that late night snack. And especially when pit the kids, the kiddos to sleep, putting the kiddos to sleep. Love eating. Scrap before bed with water and soda. Okay. Why can't she lock the door in the bathroom? She's in a house with brothers and sisters. Nobody was here today, but just that day yesterday, but me and Leah and the baby. So the boys wasn't even here. So um, do you need towels? You gave that girl. That was not a baby. That was, just, that was not a dirty towel. Nigga, what on the earth made you think people would see this video, the one I made last night? Well, respectfully. Well, girl, they watched it. Oh my God, some handsome with their hair cut. They're going to get their hair cut soon. I've seen the video where y'all like their hair was cut. This is not a hate comment. It's just sad to see those little kids not dressed right when CPS took her. Took your kids. That's the only time your kids look clean. Hold on. So you see my kids when they were gone? You show me a video where you see my kids when they were gone. Because I don't damn sure see where they was clean and their hair was done. All right. So let's, let's move on from that video. And I mean that comment. Nigga, I'm so proud of you. Words can't even describe. Now get a sitter for the weekend and go and get away and take time to recruit. You deserve it. Thank you, Lord. I appreciate the comment. At least somebody see my work. Stop that for y'all put holes in the floor. Who got it? Put it up now. Next time y'all go eat out, do the letting the person in the front. Oh, okay. Next time we eat out, next time I'll let the person. Next time we go get the order in front of us. Now you said that in the video. We'll do that next time. You have a beautiful voice, nigga. Keep on singing. He hears you. God bless you. Thank you, love. Appreciate it. I want that little baby. La, she's so cute to me. All right, love. I'm going I'm to I'm 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 cut this video because I'm going too long. But most of the comments, y'all, I appreciate all the comments. Some negative, some positive. But some people just speak their opinion when you got a whole platform out here. They want to um, just talk uh, basically about certain things. They say, did you see the wash rag she's washing the baby with to wipe the chairs down? I'm just dirty. What wash rag? The one with the shirt with my chicken and name on it. What's wrong with that? All right, this question, I'm going to end it off. I really don't recommend birth control for real. I ho honestly think it just depends on how long you take it because it will throw your hormones off. I had two periods this month taking the pills. Oh, shirts look not nice. Well, nice. The baby hand is in the fan. I seen that after the fact. Now I understand why CPS didn't want to go back with you when CPS took her. Now I understand why Leah didn't want to go back with you when CPS took her. She wants to stay with her dad. You treat that girl so wrong, but you use her to babysit all the kids while Naya, while you and Naya go ride around everywhere. What the fuck are you talking about? Oh my God. Girl, what? In a minute. Girl, I see you trying. That's what's up. Blessings to you and your families. Okay, thank you. Starring her. Birth control at such a young age is going to make it so hard for her to have kids when she gets older and going to cause many other problems. Nikki, you don't need that stuff in her body. Shit, you take it? Yeah, I take birth control. Damn, you just walk over trash? I walk over trash every day and clean up my house. Dry the chicken on season will stick. Still got water on it. You keep saying it like that. I'm telling you, you're going to put the enemy on a run. Oh, wow. 
You gotta find a video of you two saying that you don't drink water because it's nasty. I drink water every now and then. As long as it's cold, I'm good to go. I'm doing a video. Can you please give me a second? I don't have no cheese, but we just been to the store. Anyways, y'all, appreciate all the positive comments. Thank y'all um, for um, showing all the support to our channel. We appreciate everything that y'all doing for us. Thank y'all for the registry. Thank y'all for everything. All I gotta say is most of the time I do read comments and try to let my um, followers know and my haters or whatever y'all wanna call it. That you know, I see the comments and I and I do take my time out to try to make a video. Let y'all see that I do um, comment on certain videos that y'all comment on, such as negative or positive. But a lot of the um, comments come from the videos that I post. That y'all see certain things that I post that the kids be doing or be saying or whatever. Ain't nothing too bad, nothing like that. But I hope y'all um, continue to enjoy y'all um, Thursday. Stay blessed. Stay safe. Um, don't forget to turn on the notification bell when we post the video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And again, y'all, I appreciate all y'all support on my YouTube channel. And like I said, the comments is jumping, but I wanted to make sure I answer some of y'all um, questions and concerns. And let y'all know that I see, you know, the comments. And most of the time, if I don't respond back, it's because I don't feel like responding back. But see y'all guys. I thank y'all for all y'all support. Nika Busy Life in 10 edition, y'all. Continue to have a blessed Thursday. See you later.